unit under attack.
head to the front. Armor superior. Units under attack. Exposure detected. Right away. Weapons prime. Received. Objective complete. Close in. One more ion disruption for the generator is destroyed. One remains. Disruption field generators are destroyed. The force field is down. Establishing video uplink. Well, Commander, I was wrong. You did a hell of a job capturing the temple, and your timing was impeccable. Nod was in the final stages of assembling a liquid Tiberium bomb. But we've managed to secure all the materials. We also have reports Kane and his inner circle have sealed themselves off in a sub-basement of the temple. Unfortunately, the place is impenetrable, so you'll have to sweat them out. Tell me, General. Our ASAT defenses, they're back online, are they not? You're not suggesting the ion cannon. No, General, I'm not suggesting it. I'm ordering it. You realize we're talking about a facility where liquid Tiberium was being manufactured. An ion cannon blast could be disastrous to the region. Sandra, I need Dr. Giraud in Brazil. Dr. Giraud is our leading Tiberian scientist. Hopefully he can talk you out of General, this. General, this is a nod controlled yellow zone. Whatever the repercussions of the ion strike may be, my concerns are not for the locals of this region. My concerns are for our public, the GDI populace who have been promised payback for the Philadelphia. For God's sakes, man, don't make this about your political credibility. Excuse me, General, but Dr. Giraud is missing, and it appears he's been captured by Nod. Well, that settles it. Commander, I want you to end this once and for all. Incoming transmission. GDI Central Command has ordered the use of the Ion Cannon on Temple Prime. Already. Intelligence data updated. What do you have? Push it forward. Ready here. Select target. Kane and much of his inner circle are believed to have been killed. The explosion also detonated a liquid Tiberium deposit hidden beneath the temple itself, producing deadly fallout and radiation levels over most of Eastern Europe. It's still unclear at this time if this was an accident or a final desperate act of terrorism by Kane. So far, the only response from GDI has been this statement from Acting Director Boyle. All those innocent lives lost. It's just unthinkable. 
But if there's a silver lining to this terrible tragedy, it's the fact that Cain's reign of terror has finally ended. And for that, I think we should all be eternally grateful. Hey!